All right, corners. Remember, orange stage, orange stage, orange stage. Good job in the swerve. Woo. All right, so we're going to be going into a corner, okay? So just take a look. This is all you can see right there. Let's get a better, let's get a better uh, marker here. That's all you can see. So remember what I said earlier in the stream is that this is all you have to work with. This is all the available tarmac and asphalt. That is what you have to work with. So if you're going 200 miles, let's say 200 miles an hour. If you're going 200 miles an hour, can you stop with this amount? No. Okay, let's say 150. No, probably not. 100? Probably not. 70? We're cutting it. 55-ish? Uh, I think we can handle this amount of vision, this amount of room at 55. And it's like, well, the road keeps going. You know, the road keeps going, right? The road doesn't just end. You don't have to stop right here. But that's the thing. You're assuming the road keeps going. Once if you know, flash flood took out the road. Once if a car is turning left in front of us and we can't see it. That is what I'm trying to get at with you guys, is that if this is all you can see, this is the only available asphalt that you can see, that is what you should be able to ride your speed in. Okay, You're not supposed to go 150 assuming, well, the road keeps going. That's an assumption. Okay, There's a, there's a phrase for that, right? Uh, so right here, you need to. You need to modulate your speed with the vision that you have. Once it opens up, go ahead and, and haul butt if you want. But somebody said here uh, he had great position. You're right. Absolutely right. This is what I love about the live streams. I love that you guys show up to these live streams and help me out with this uh, and keep me on track. Okay, so lane position one, two, and three. If he was in lane position three, maybe this is like all you can see. Lane position one, you can see all the way around. So very good lane positioning. Remember, plan your ride. Make sure you subscribe also, by the way, guys. If you're not subscribed, just hit that subscription button. It's just, just a little button right there. If you want to click the join button, click it too. It's up to you. All right, this is the moment you perceived something. He already got 99 lives, did a great job already having the arrow up. Perceived something. So what do we do in this situation? This is why you go out and get a motorcycle training class, okay? You go out and get at least the basics. Get the basics, okay? Make sure you maintain your fundamental skills after you get those basics, those fundamental skills. Be a smart rider. But the thing is, you have to be situationally aware. You have to actually see the hazard in the first place to even do anything. So good on him for actually being able to see what's happening. Good on the rider. I don't know if it's a uh, – I don't know. It's a rider. So good on the rider for actually seeing vision, situational awareness, and now fundamental skills. So what do we do? This is where you're going to learn in class is that you can either stand it up. So you're going to – Stand it up and then break. Or if you took an advanced class, you're already doing trail breaking through the corner. So now you can squeeze more and more and more while standing it up. So that's why you always go get advanced classes. You keep trying to learn. Always have a beginner's mind. Another thing is that he can always, you know, if he has available traction, so we roll off the throttle. Remember, traction takes uh, is basically, I'm sorry, acceleration, deceleration, turning takes away traction. So if we're accelerating here, let's go ahead and give ourselves a little bit more traction. It's slowly roll off that throttle, maybe apply a little bit of that front brake, just a little bit so that we have good traction on that front tire and then slowly turn more into it so we can, you know, go this way. Now, it's, every situation is dependent on what's happening. Uh, this is why you need to take your uh, advanced classes. But he did a great job. He he navigated this threat. He navigated this rider navigated this threat. Great job, great job. Not much you could have done different. What you just saw was a clip from the live stream, which we do all the time on this channel every single week. So if you want to click that subscribe button, I think it's right here. Maybe it's right here. I don't know. There's videos on the screen, Matt. What do I do? 